Oh, f We're in Whistler Bike Park and uh, we've just come up the Fitzsimmons lift and we are going to show you how you can regress quickly on jumps in Whistler. So we're just opposite the Olympic Station. Uh, from the, you'll, you'll ride past A-Line and then come up and there's some blues, pretty easy flowy trails just to get in the flow of Whistler. We're going to go down crank it up because it's got some pretty fun jumps that you can get used to just being in the air and they're built super well. So start practicing stuff. And there's two options over here. You can ride the little joyride jump part, which is just two jumps and like a selection of drops to progress on, uh, or you can just do a nice flowy bermy track to the next bit of jumpy section. I hope you saw that uh, last whiff that actually worked well for me. Did you see it? Uh huh. I got was it. it. Good. Yeah. <laughs> for me, crank it up was a good stepping stone for a line because there's some really quite high lips, which is what you kind of need to get the feel of going off if you want to do some of the jumps on a line. So you have done the jumps on Crank It Up and Seymour. The next sort of step up from that for jumps is A-Line. A-Line's got, there's a bit of an aura around it. It's got a big reputation. The jumps are big, but they're like, they're pretty good for people to learn, like to jump bigger jumps on. They're built really well and they're all tabletops. So yeah, pretty good for progressing on. So we're just out shooting photos. There's a kid who wants to come and try and flip. This jump, it's pretty big, it sends you quite high. Oh. You alright? Yeah, no pain at all. Are you sure? Yeah, not even a Oh my god. Apparently I don't know, remember how to backflip. <laughs> Fair play for trying. I what? was doing them perfect yesterday on my BMX. <laughs> you sure you're alright? Yeah, yeah. 
Oh, sweet. Yeah, so first time in Whistler. Um, I guess there's nothing else like this. You don't really get a chance to hit big jumps in succession. Started on A-line, which was, yeah, a bit of an eye-opener for me. A lot bigger than it looks in the videos, but like super confidence-inspiring. They're just so well-built. You stop really thinking about the size of the jumps. And then, uh, yeah, moving on to Dirt Merchant was really nervous. But yeah, again, just so confidence-inspiring in terms of hitting big jumps and uh, getting your confidence on them, really. 